UFC welterweight Jorge Masvidal stated that he doesn't believe the hype of Calm's at just yet. Jorge Masvidal has become one of the biggest draws in the sport after Conor McGregor, having spent almost two decades fighting professionally. Masvidal fought the current welterweight king Kamaru Usman twice and headlined Madison Square Garden in a bout against Nate Diaz in November 2019. In an appearance on YouTube sensation Logan Paul's impulsive podcast, Jorge Masvidal shared his thoughts on rising UFC prospect Kamzat. When asked if he believed Kamzat is beatable, Masvidal answered. I don't think SHT of him, he hasn't fought anybody. He's got a while to go, he's got to go fight some guys first. Masvidal thinks the UFC promotes Kamzat because they want to expand their market. They talk big about everybody they think they can get money from. They know that he can bring in those Arabic countries that got a lot of money. But as far as him having fought and beaten guys, I haven't seen one guy yet that he's beaten and I'm like, okay. He beat up somebody good. Jorge Masvidal has been in the news recently due to his physical altercation in the public with Colby Covington. Following a dominant loss to Covington at UFC 2.72, Masvidal allegedly assaulted Covington outside a restaurant in Miami. His appearance on the podcast marks his first statement about the incident publicly, besides the brief video and tweet he shared right after the alleged attack. While the episode was uploaded yesterday, it's unclear whether it was recorded before UFC 2.73 or after it. Kam Zat came out on top at UFC 2.73 on April 9 when he beat a former title challenger Gilbert Burns. In the interview, Game Bread does not make a note of the war Kam Zat had with Burns and is not asked by Paul or the other hosts about the Swedish fighter's biggest victory. It could be that they recorded the interview before the fight and are just uploading it after. Who do you think Jorge Masvidal should fight next? Hit the subscribe button and share this video. We'll be uploading several times a week, sharing the latest MMA and fight news with you. Let us know what you think in the comments below.